I first got interested in the industry since I was a little girl. My great grandmother, she uh, used to be, she used to make dresses herself. She taught my mom, and my mom taught me. And I wanted to be a, I, I, I dream of being a big editor when I was uh, older. Of, co uh, of course, now times have changed, and the fact that there's the internet, my dream kind of moved a little bit. But it's something that I have since all my life. The first thing that I would say to somebody that wants to start a blog, I think it would be to do it for the right reasons. Never do it for the money, never do it for the fame because that's not the reason why you start a blog. You have to do it because you love doing it, you want to share your passion and your view, your point of view with, with other people and then that will take you further. But if you do it for the wrong reasons, then you might uh, end up frustrated because there's so much competition now. So you have to put a lot of quality into your blog and time. And that's a lot of people don't understand that you have to put a lot of time into, into it. You can, you can interact with them through Facebook, through Twitter, through the blog. So the interaction and also the fact that you are somebody they can relate to and interact that's, that, that creates a bond and that's the reason why I think bloggers are becoming bigger and bigger. So my, my story as a blogger has been a process and I've been going through stages so I think that everything has kind of come natural to me. It's not like it all of a sudden happened you know, out of nowhere so I think it's, it's been a process and that's how I've been learning to handle things as they come along.